All right, so in this problem, we are looking to find the lowest value of these fractions. So let's start with the first one. We have one, we have half, which is like 50%. Um, so let's move on. We don't want to calculate anything there. Now, our second one is one third plus one sixth. Now, we'll add these together by finding a common denominator, and the common denominator will be six, so we'll multiply the one third by two on the numerator and in the denominator. So now we have our new um, equation of two over six plus one over six. If we add these together, we get three over six. Now also, if we simplify this, we see that we get one half if we divide the numerator by two and the denominator by two. So meaning that the first answer and the second answer are equal to one another. So they cannot be the lowest ones because there has to be one lowest value. Now let's move on to one fourth plus one fifth. Our least common denominator here will be 20. So we'll multiply the four by five and also the numerator by five. And here we'll multiply by four on the top and bottom. And we'll get our new equation to be 5 over 20 plus 4 over 20. Now when we add these, we'll get 9 over 20, which is a bit less than half, because half of 20 would be 10 over 20. So let's keep this one in mind. Now let's move on to our last one, just to make sure that it's not smaller than 9 over 20. So we have 2 over fifths plus 1 third. Our common denominator here will be 15, so we'll multiply this side by 3 and we'll multiply the, this side by 5. So our new equation will be 6 over 15 plus 5 over 15. Now when we add these together, we get 11 over 15, which is much larger than half of 15, meaning that 920 will be our final answer.